Hello everybody. Welcome to what I think arguably is the most exciting quick chat uh, that we've seen today. My name is uh, Rear Admiral Frank Morley. I'm the Director of Navy International Programs. Really, this is such a high demand mission today. If you think about it, the National Defense Strategy, it's one of three lines of effort, partners and allies. Our most strategic center of gravity as a country is our partners and allies, and those with the most friends typically tend to win, right? And so we see uh, it's a tremendous uh, increase in uh, business today. Uh, we see that uh, this is, uh, uh, it, it influences the partners that uh, we have in order to build greater partnership and a connection generational. Uh, across the uh, many countries across the globe. It provides us combat capability and capacity and interoperability uh, amongst our partners and fills gaps that we don't have uh, in our inventory. And uh, it of course also brings in uh, dollars into uh, the U.S. industrial base. So an incredibly uh, important mission. This mission has uh, brings in, we brought in Navy, Marine Corps, and Coast Guard alone has brought in over 35 billion the last two years of uh, income uh, coming in through foreign military sales. Add about 800 uh, million uh, each year in cooperative programs that other countries bring in that we don't have to pay for. Uh, and then about three times the foreign military sales and direct commercial sales that industry is doing out there. So you can see it's a tremendously important mission area. So what I want to do uh, real quick today is really talk about three main areas. Uh, alignment, alignment, execution, and uh, cultural change. And this really the imperatives that we've been going forward on. So on the alignment piece, uh, as I said, this is a growing critical mission. We double, triple the amount of work coming in uh, that we're producing across the infrastructure. Uh, Navy, Marine Corps, and Coast Guard. And so it's incredibly important that we have our priorities straight. We understand what's the most important from a uh, operational theater commander standpoint because we have limited capacity. And what do we work on first and what do we push? So that's incredibly important and we're, uh, we work really hard on that and I am extremely proud of uh, the efforts that everybody's done. We've been able to operationalize this mission. We have uh, tremendous communications with all the fleet staffs. Uh, we have tremendous communications uh, across the, the uh, RDA and the PEO so we understand what the most important uh, production line fills are or synergies or multi-year opportunities that we have in order to uh, make uh, more uh, economical our own uh, efforts there and uh, so our efforts to operationalize this and our uh, drum beats of communication with the uh, fleet staffs, with the COCOMs and across the U.S. industrial base both government and industry has been wonderful I just want to thank everybody for that effort. So that's a line.